Hello, this is Bobby Holiday and Leslie Thompson. We are Ganesha Yoga Studio in Elyria, Ohio. And we are here today to bring Thai massage, which Leslie is going to do a demonstration on the Greg, the station manager. But before that, we're going to talk a little bit about Leslie and me. I'm Bobby, and I'm Leslie's mom. She's been doing yoga with me since she was six years old, standing on her head at uh, all for um, show and tell in school and such and has studied, outstudied me as far as yoga courses. Uh, I studied yoga in 1965 with a private teacher in uh, Cleveland, Ohio, but then she's gone on and on to various uh, master teachers. And is, anyway, Leslie, welcome. Thank you, Mom. And? I'm a professional student. <laughs> exactly. Forever and ever. Before we even do that, let's breathe. Let's inhale and exhale. And breathe with us, please. On the next ring, inhale. Fill your lungs with light and love and beauty and health. Exhale. One more. Breathe in. When you breathe out, you breathe out all doubt. All dismay, uh, discouragement, and breathe in light. We're going to do three rounds of breath of joy, so join us as well. Clasp your hands and push forward. Inhale. Exhale. Pull your hands to your heart. Open your ribcage. Lift your lungs. Raise your arms to the sky. And inhale. Reach up. Watch your neighbor as you exhale your hands behind you. Clasp your hands behind your back. Stretch the throat. Inhale. Release. Exhale. Breathing with us. Breath is life. Breathe in. Push forward. Bring hands to heart. Breathing out. Exhale. Breathe in and reach. Lift, lift, lift. Press your arms against your ears. Release. Exhale. Stretch your throat. Breathe in. One last one. Palms together. Feel the change in your heartbeat slightly lifted. Forward on your in-breath. This time straight to the ceiling and exhale. Lift, lift, lift. And reach up, in-breath. Exhale, hands. And stretch. Release. Palms together. And namaste is our sacred greeting Acknowledging the God within, the light that shines within all of us. Namaste. Namaste. And namaste, Leslie. Namaste, Mother. I'm looking at Leslie right now, recalling we're on the back porch of our little farmhouse, and I thought she'd been taking her nap, and I was just going on, chanting, oh, and I opened my eyes, and she's sitting right in front of me, as beautiful as six as she is now. Says, Mommy, why does that make me feel so good? Do you know why it makes you feel so good? Because it speaks to your heart. Because of the vibration. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So let's do it alone. Okay. resonating within you. So, welcome back again. Now I'm more here. Right. More of the real me. We're more here. Once you've uh, gone into sacred sound. Let's go back to your very first yoga class. My very first yoga class. It must have been with me, but we don't know who, remember when. 
Well, I think it was in my teenage years joining your class at the Y. I don't remember specifically. Of course, I started at four chanting Om on the porch. Mm -hmm. I guess just being your daughter. Mm -hmm. Lucky. Then you've traveled Yogikana. Yogi, Yogi Kana you met when you were... Well, I met the swamis who came to our door, walking around the backyard in their saffron robes. The one named me Miss India. Mm -hmm. I was, was pretty little. So I've... You were about seven. i all my life, thanks to you. And then for yoga teacher training, I went out to California, to Ananda, mm -hmm. in the Sierra Nevada mountains, called the Expanding Light. Mm -hmm. Spent a month there. And I also went down to Yogi Hari, in uh, Fort Lauderdale, Florida for, I think that was 10 day training, but it was so transforming because it was in his home. Yeah. And living the life. Living the life of the yogi, and chanting every evening. And that was beautiful. And you did more than chant, you did dishes? <laughs> yes, we always do dishes and beds. And this part and of it, there are many kinds of yoga, one of them is... And that changed my attitude about work too, about getting something for what you do, rather than just if it's on the floor, pick it up. It doesn't mm -hmm. matter if you did it or not. Mm -hmm. It sort of just changes your yeah. attitude. So that's one of the yogas. It's called service. Karma yoga is the yoga of service. And being knowledgeable that, that you can help, that you can make a difference. Mm -hmm. and it makes you more a part of the, the community. And then for Thai yoga massage, which was very recent training, I found integral yoga in Greenwich Village, actually the West Village in Manhattan where I live now. And I was just looking for free places to meditate and found someone I met in a laughter yoga class told me about the Integral Yoga Friday Night's Deep Relaxation class. So I started going there and then I started going through their brochure and I saw that you can learn a 90 minute massage in one week for $500 and I thought, oh, that just struck a chord. Mm -hmm. And in one week it was true. I was giving these wonderful massages and I bought this mat from Lotus Palm in Montreal, and which is where I'm being certified. And Thai yoga and pants. where my teacher was certified. And of course, the fisherman's pants from Thailand, which are the most comfortable pants in the world. And tie them the dragon t-shirt, and it all goes together with the Thai. But who would have known even six weeks ago or six months ago? When you, no, when you really open life your, transforming. It's when you open things your heart come to you when you're ready. And this came. And then for second level, I went to Kripalu because I found that there's a teacher there who is certified to teach the Lotus Palm from Montreal in practice. So I just spent a week there last week for my second level. And then after I do 15 for free, I'm certified. <laughs> well, one of them tonight, one of so them it's tonight. It's really very accessible. Any, almost anyone can do it. Leslie has found a way to live in Manhattan. Well, my boyfriend well, lives in Manhattan. And she's in like, access, she's accessing uh, every opportunity. And it's it, almost like you can go to free meditation classes and free yoga classes. And everyone mm -hmm. thinks the whole world is so expensive. But it's not if you know how to say, oh, this sounds like a, something I want to do. And all of a sudden you're doing it. Mm -hmm. And now you're doing time aside. I think you dream it. And then it's yeah, the, the dream reminds me. Then, then when it comes up, it's, it took a long time to get there. I think I wanted to move to Manhattan. Mm -hmm days, but this is the right time. Mm -hmm. So the Thai massage. Thai is, yoga massage. Uh, thai yoga massage. It's also called assisted yoga massage, assisted yoga posture. So when basically Americans, I mean the, the Western a yoga person or community thinks of yoga as being just postures, and it is a lot of body work. Uh, but it's also deep philosophy and, uh, and spirituality that uh, just permeates your whole being. So the Thai yoga massage is called, is called assisted yoga. And so it follows along the, the ancient yoga uh, path, 2,500 years old, pre-Buddhism. Mm -hmm. At least. Mm -hmm. Except it's someone doing it for you, mm -hmm. so you're in a completely relaxed state. And they're giving you what we call metta, which means loving kindness. Right. So we always remember metta, metta, to keep our mind and spirit in what we're practicing and being in the moment. In the Let present. that be the new word for today, metta. Metta. Loving kindness. Mm -hmm. And who are we kind to first? Ourselves. 
ourselves. Other uh, Yogi Hari you studied with, Yogi uh, Amrit? A little, uh, just a few days with Amrit in Florida. These names are And wonderful. that was for Yoga Nidra training. Oh, Yoga Nidra is More sleeping with consciousness. Yoga consciousness it's while you're sleeping. Super conscious relaxation. So you're, you're still awake, you're conscious, but you're going deeper and deeper and deeper and deeper states of relaxation. I've observed this to my own practice that I have a need to get more and more increasingly quiet. Then I look in the magazine, somebody's offering these classes, you know, how to go into deep sleep and still be doing it awake. And, but these are yoga, yoga teachers are bringing that concept forth. Mm -hmm. We need to rest. We need to rest. <laughs> we need to sleep deeply. We need to dream deeply and beautifully. Anything else to share? Before I do the demonstration? Um. Well, maybe a little explanation of what I'm doing. Okay. Using my body weight, mostly. So it's really, it's kind of a dance around the recipient. I'm using like rolling pin, we call this rolling pin on the shoulders, and then we press, just by, it's like a dance around the body, and we press the meridians, the energy lines. Mm -hmm. And we go into different poses, like kind of Tai Chi poses, and put the body into yoga poses. But as we do that, we're pressing along the sun lines, meridians, energy lines to unblock anything that's stagnant there. And then we just give it to the universe. And I will do maybe 15 minutes. 15 right minutes. Now. And we're inviting our station manager, Greg, to avail himself to his first Thai yoga massage experience. And if you, as you're watching, maybe you want to find somebody to go along with you, you know, if, you, if there are two people there, one of you can do the massage. Watch. Where do you need me? Hello, Greg. Hi. Where am I going? You're going to sit right in the center, All right. facing your camera. Okay. And if you can sit comfortably in cross-legged position. Yeah. Wow. I'm impressed. And this might make it... Actually, I'm going to use one of these for your back. So. Okay. I think your knees are okay, right? Mm hmm Okay. So just take a few deep breaths through your nose. May I be here like an angel on the side? Okay. And relax. I'm not just say my prayer. talk as we're doing through this? Sure, you can oh, okay. say, oh, that feels good. Because oh, it does. <laughs> I didn't know if I was allowed to mention that or not. Normally in the practice, you want to close your eyes and just receive. You're welcome to do whatever you want. Mm. I thought maybe if I gave a running commentary, people would understand how wonderful this is. <laughs> Go ahead. Because this, this is, is great. Just the healing touch, right? Yeah, it's just... Anyone can do this. picking up your energy, your heat. Is it good? It's beautiful. Oh, okay. And then this is meta stroke. So every time we finish one part, we give our meta stroke. Hmm. You feel already, this, already blissing. This is good. <laughs> Do you like deep massage? I, you know, I, this is the first massage I've ever had. Really? Yes. I'm honored. I'm not big on massages, but oh, maybe this will change your mind. I was the uh, the guinea pig before the show. I thought, well, geez, I'm not going to let the other guys do this. I'm going to do it. So. I was, one of the things I Leslie gave just me my first your arm. I'll just take all the weight. Okay. okay. And just lift your head up. Oh, yeah, this is... rotate your shoulder a little bit. 
So this style is so more like with the, with, with the muscle, not with the muscles as much, but it's with the joints and the... That's the hardest thing to do is just to get the recipient to relax and not do all the work for me. Because then you get more of a stretch. Okay, am I... Am I... You're trying to work for me. Oh, so I'm sorry. So take an inhale and give me all the weight of your arm. You're not too heavy for me at all. I'm very strong. Inhale. Exhale. This is really, really neat. I'm pretty new into water pump bugs. Normally I wouldn't be talking it, but it makes it a little more interesting. Okay, what does that mean exactly? It's just a fun name for it, because okay. it kind of looks like a water pump. Oh, all right. I have horrible posture, so if I just... This keep, might help your posture. If I keep telling me to straighten my back out, or I'll start leaning forward. Okay. So I'm just bringing your arm back a little bit. Does it feel okay? Mm-hmm. Very gently remembering always metta. The idea is to relax you. very systematic how this works. So I'm just rotating my shoulder back as I lean back. So I bring my body weight back. And then I have my thumb going up the scapula, just gently. Feel anything? Oh, it's, yeah. <laughs> so inhale. Exhale. I'm going to want to go to sleep after this. You might even nap. <laughs> I mean, that, that's kind of the end result of it. You feel it releases so much that you can go into a deep yoga nidra. We did one side, now we need to do the other side. Okay. Rolling pin. Just roll. Press and roll. You almost forget you're in a TV studio when you're doing this. Mm -hmm. You know, I mean, it's kind of like the cameras go away and the... Mm -hmm. It took me a second there, I'm like, oh, wait a minute, I'm on television right now. So that's, for the people at home, that's how relaxing it is. Just give me your arm. Oh, that's right. Oh, you want to stretch it yourself. Oh, no, I... <laughs> okay, just relax. This is kind of similar to the stretching we used to do when I played baseball a little bit. Mm. Not with the, you know, obviously not with the relaxation and all that, but... Okay, so let it drop there, you put it away. <laughs> there you go, that's what I want.
this is the next message, so I'm just going like this. So. Can use thumbs. What is this called? Shampoo. I won't knock Everybody my hair piece likes off. The oh, I'm just kidding. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Some of the hair to grow back while you're up there. Skull tap and grab it. Well, <laughs> stimulate the scalp. Might be a little too late. <laughs> <laughs> hey, don't lose any more though. Still have bangs. <laughs> yeah, there you go. And now this one. So meta stroke. And now lace your fingers. Like that? Your head. So hold on to your head. Here, go that way. That way? Okay. So this one. Open up your shoulders. So I have my knee right in the middle of your back. I have the bolster to protect you. So inhale. And exhale. Oh boy. <laughs> Okay, now I'm going to walk on your back. Okay. Bring your arms back. You're getting really good at that. Being relaxed. So it's not, the, 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 the massage, I mean, it's, you can't help but relax. <laughs> okay. So hold on to my wrists. Where are your wrists? Okay. All right. Now, am I pulling or are you just... Here, let me have your wrist first and then you hold on to mine. Okay. Can you grab mine? Yeah. There you go. Okay, so just inhale. So I push, and then exhale, relax, come back. Oh! <laughs> forward. Ah, and relax back. Feel anything? Opening. And one more time. Walk up a little higher. Inhale. Like jelly over here, or jello. Know, come down, all the way down on your elbows if you can. Oh, that's gonna comfortable. be comfortable. Uh, pretty much. Mm. Now I'm palming your energy lines in the back. Two of the seventy-two thousand that we have. Because you're tall, I'll stand up and change my stance. I didn't think it was possible for me to be in this position. Learning things about yourself. Yeah, I'm more limber than I thought I was. <laughs> you are. Yeah, a lot of people can't sit in the lotus, especially in blue jeans. Now your cameramen are really jealous. <laughs> well, they're probably thinking they could wish they could do the same thing with a bat or something. Oh. So Meta stroke brings me back to center. Awesome. It's so easy, you're light as air. Yeah. <laughs> okay, now inhale. One more thing. Exhale. Just roll back. Where am I going? <laughs> I have you. Okay. Going right back to a pillow. Oh, alright. Oh, yeah, no problem there. Okay. Mmm. I don't want to get
get up. You don't need this bat back, do you? <laughs> I know how to roll you right off the mat. Okay. In fact, since I don't want my back to the camera, we'll do something special. Are you going to flip around? It's called the lotus flip. Okay. So if I want you on your belly in the middle of the mat, All right. pick up your legs and you have to be relaxed. Okay. Well, you're going to turn me all the way around, huh? Just scoot you over a little bit. <laughs> Just relax your head down. Okay. All right. See how beautiful it is? It is a dance. Okay. All right. Arms interlaced behind your head again. It's called the lotus split. Okay. Oh, you're swinging me around. <laughs> it's like karate time. You're supposed to relax your legs. You have to try that over. Okay. All right, wait a minute. Where was I at? Okay, your legs are straight. All right. Over there. Okay. Okay. You're just going to follow. You don't do anything. All right. <laughs> <laughs> That's the idea. Okay. So am I where I need to be now? So now you're on your belly, but scoots back to the center. Okay. Quite do it. All right. So how do I, where do you want me, like just? You could just be right there. Okay. Right there. I don't know how much more cup. time we have. Okay. That'll all work. And the FBI lock. Oh. Okay, so. Something I'm familiar with. Let's open up your shoulders. Back over. Which way? So I could either ask you to turn or I could turn you. You can just ask me. Would you mind turning, please? Which way? Facing the camera. All right. Up. Namaste. Okay, thank you. Namaste. Feel any different? I feel great. Good. <laughs> I feel. <laughs> I feel wonderful. That was just a mini wow. Thai yoga massage. <sighs> no, can I just lay down here and take a nap now? <laughs> sure. We'll turn the lights off for you. No, it's it, it was great. It really was wonderful. Okay to the camera. Thank you, Leslie Thompson and Greg, our station manager, bringing this wonderful ancient new uh, tradition nation and what is it, therapy. Mm -hmm. therapy. Highly recommended. See you next time. We're going to be doing basic yoga with moi, Bobby. <laughs> <laughs>